Well, 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 look what we have here. How's it going, ma'am? That almost felt wrong. <laughs> that almost felt wrong. Hello, everybody. We are back here on the Hunter Call of the Wild with a uh, nice little early morning hunt. We're going to be doing some multiplayer hopping in Emerald Coast with some weapons that I don't use as often. We got the 470 here. We also have the 223 AR because I really want to see what its performance is like now that they've buffed it. And then we've got the uh, we got the 454 with us and also the 22 Viren. So let's get out there and find some multiplayer trophies. You know, just to see how it does, let's use the 223 on uh, this little sandbar deer because it should be the proper class for it. In fact, this should be like the highest you could possibly go uh, using the 223. It'll give us a good representation of what it does to them. And I mean, definitely way better than it would have done pre-update. Well, there's our sandbar deer. Let's see what the damage is like. That is a single lung hit. And did we get any quick kill? No, of course we didn't. But, you know, it is what it is. And improper ammo. I thought 223 was 2 to 5, or uh, 2 to 6. I thought 223 was 2 to 6. Is it 2 to 5, actually? I, I, I guess it's 2 to 5. 2 to 4, okay. So, that was definitely not an animal you're supposed to shoot with it, but that uh, did really good on it, surprisingly. I'm actually kind of blown away at how quickly it died, considering it's way too large of an animal for it. Ooh. Ooh, that is huge. That is a huge hog deer right there. That very well could be a potential diamond. We got to get to the right gun. Oh my gosh, that could be a diamond right there. That might be a diamond level four. If it is, that is incredible. Uh, we need to try and get its attention. And there's a really nice one next to it as well. Man, all of a sudden we found ourselves some really nice hog deer. Sadly, I couldn't get a good shot on that other one, but we got the main one down. This very well could be a diamond hog deer, and that is looking really good. That looks like it's got a very good chance, and... ah oh, man. You know, actually, for some reason... Never mind, it, it actually didn't have... I don't, I don't think it actually had a chance of making it. For some reason, I thought 98 was diamond, but it's 108. Well, it just goes to show how much I hunt the hog deer. But I, I could have swore that it was the proper the proper uh, score range, but I guess I was wrong. I was off by 10 points on the uh, diamond estimate. You know, still a pretty solid hog deer, though I'll take that any day. It's a good looking one. Oh no, here we go. You know, it never fails to uh, amaze me. We got a million crocs going for us every single time that we hunt on this map. Honestly, pretty insane. Well, 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 look what we have here. How's it going, ma'am? That almost felt wrong. <laughs> that almost felt wrong. I think that's a rare kangaroo. I am 99% sure that that right there is a leucistic kangaroo. It looks like it. One shot to the chest and that should take her down. She looks way lighter than the other ones. Yeah, definitely. She is 100% a rare. That is crazy. I decided to switch servers because I couldn't find anything good on the other server and it looked like there was a ton of need zones that I didn't really realize were there before. So. I decided to swap servers as that one seemed to be just picked clean and literally like the fourth zone we find has a rare kangaroo in it. We checked all these and there was nothing and this appears to be a rare. I couldn't imagine this being anything else. I mean, maybe we're wrong. Oh, we are wrong. Wow. <laughs> so that's a gray. That looked so different from the others. I was absolutely sure that it was leucistic, but I guess not. You know, this really has been one of those days where everything looked like a trophy. We had that kangaroo just trick us, and then we also had the hog deer trick us. It's just one of those days, I guess. Never bend the knee, man. I would have just kicked this person the second they jumped in and spammed, please sleep seven. <laughs> that is a, that is just absurd. I would have kicked them immediately. And they literally left right after begging for that time change. Talk about a waste of a good Rue server. 
This could have been the one. I rarely see anybody uh, doing Rue time, and unfortunately, it's ruined now. You know, this is making me want to go onto my map and hunt some kangaroos. So I think that's what we're going to do for the rest of this video, because multiplayer has been kind of dead today. Not going to lie. It has been very dead. Well, let's just go ahead and boop. That is one kangaroo going down. Oh my gosh. That is a level nine red fox. What a crazy thing to run across while we're just looking for the kangaroos. Oh my gosh. This hunt has honestly gone from disaster to hopefully a diamond. That is crazy. I'm just here to try and find some kangaroo trophies and instead we run across a fox. <laughs> That is insane. I remember I used to have such a difficult time finding level 9 red fox and ever since this map has come out, I think we've found three of them. One in early access, one that trolled me uh, in multiplayer. I don't think I even posted that one. And then now we've got this one on our own map. This is wild. We're going to get a chance to use that brand new uh, and powerful 223 on it. And by brand new, I just mean, you know, updated stats on it. Well, let's real quickly grab our kangaroo. That is a level seven gold scoring gray brown male. That's our level nine. That's our level nine right there. Let's see if we can get his attention. We got his attention. Oh my gosh. This could be a crazy shot that we might have to take here, but sometimes you just got to do what you got to do. That guy's about 230 away. If he gives us a shot, we'll take it. If not, then we won't. Um, I only have one scope on me. The one time I really wish I had brought the Argus, I didn't. Well, that's unfortunate. It looks like he's moving towards us, though, so we may be okay. I don't want to take a risky shot if we don't have to, so we're going to let him get a little bit closer and then take him down. Okay, he is just walking back to us, so we actually should be okay to just keep ourselves crouched and move forward a little bit. I think we should be able to see him very, very soon. I think we should be able to get a shot on him very, very soon. He's about 136 away, and he's getting closer. As long as we just stay low and stay quiet, he shouldn't spook off. And uh, then we should be able to get a very close and safe shot on him. Here we go. And that will be the end of that fox right there. Let's go. That is insane. I'm out here for kangaroos after multiplayer completely failed us, and instead we find a level 9 legendary fox. Now, let's just hope it makes it. Um, I don't remember what diamond is for them. That estimate honestly might be a guaranteed diamond. Is that... There's no way. Is that a, uh... Is that a black feral goat? Or is that a red brown? Well, we're gonna have to chase that down after and just at least grab a track, because it did look kind of dark. But this guy right here is very likely a diamond fox yep that's a diamond 15 16 is that max weight wait is that makes i think that's max weight 1540 i believe is max weight if i'm not mistaken i could be wrong there though either way this is my biggest fox of all time and i accident i accidentally clicked through i i'm pretty sure we taxed him but I accidentally clicked through. <laughs> uh, let's just just make sure that we taxed him real quickly. I think we should have. Ah, uh, yes, we did. Oh my gosh, we did. We taxed him. We're good. Well, unfortunately, I don't really have any place I'd like to put this fox, so it looks like it's not going to go in our main lodge. But I do appreciate each and every one of you guys watching this video. If you enjoyed, be sure to leave a like. And also, if you guys want to see an entire video dedicated to just kangaroos, be sure to leave a comment down below as that is how I will know that you guys want to see that. Also, if you haven't already and you're new to the channel, consider subscribing as I post content like this every single day. Thank you for watching and I will see you all in the next one. Peace.